what's up traders welcome back to forex life in today's video we will be focusing on a scalping strategy for volatility 75 we'll be using the one minute time frame for this because it is a scalping strategy also if it is your first time on this channel please like subscribe and comment below also click on the link in the description that i will drop down below where you can find my recommended brokers and also get access to my free telegram group so this is the telegram group where i drop some signals um share some insight so you guys can go and have a look at that also follow me on tiktok where i drop videos on teaching you guys how to trade as well as instagram of course you guys can follow me there the link will be in the description below but nevertheless let's get straight into the video okay so what we're going to be using for this strategy is we will just be using three indicators now a lot of you guys have asked me for a scalping strategy for volatility 75 so let's have a look at this and see what we can get okay what we are able to do with this strategy today so the first indicator what we want to add so what you want to do is you want to click on the little f icon and then you want to go ahead and add your ichimoku okay so what we're going to do is the first setting over here we're just going to change that period to one second one will also be one we will change that to 70 and we will click on full because we want to include the, all the colors okay sorry about that guys so we're going to click on full so what we're going to do is we're going to change this to one pixel under styles change that to one pixel so whatever your background of your chart is so mine is white so i'm going to change that to white right and then the last one one pixel and we change that to white as well so now the purple which will be our sell the brown will be our buy so we're going to change that let's make it this green and our cell we make red okay we don't need any levels for this so just click on done and your ichimoku should look like that i know it looks confusing but it's not it's not confusing at all you guys will understand once i do the full explanation of the video then the next indicator we want to add is our relative strength index so we go ahead and we add that we change the period to one we leave it on close two pixel all we do is we change these levels so these levels we will change to level 20 and we'll change this to level 75 so in the description this will be our buy and this will be our sell okay we can change this to black maybe make that two pixel and we click on done so that is how it should look okay so now we have our relative strength index in indicator window one we go back to our indicator list we click on indicator window one and we're just going to add our ichimoku there again so we just click on done same settings so now you guys can automatically see how this strategy works it's really simple don't use it on higher time frames i won't recommend it i haven't tested it on higher time frames i've only tested it on the one minute for scalping because that is what you guys requested a, a scalping strategy for v75 volatility 75 so when we have a look at it right over here when it's red on the cell zone and it's red at the top as well you take the cell until you're happy with your profits or you can go ahead and stay in the trade until it changes to green right so that's a nice cell there once it changes green at the bottom on your buy zone and it's green on the main chart you take your buy and you go ahead and you take your buy and here it changed red 
so we will take our profits so you would have entered over here and you would have taken your profits over there all right now there are times where you will get confused with the strategy i'm just looking for an example like over here because it's in the buy zone you'll automatically think to take a buy but don't take a buy because it's red red means sell we're not taking this buy even though it's in the buy zone we're not going to take it okay we'll wait till it's green green should be in your buy zone red should be in your sell zone so let's look so here's a nice example with the sell zone over here the red at the top as well we take our sell and here we can see it's starting to change green so we're going to take our profits we take our profits we bag that money and we wait for the next opportunity carry on over here is an example what i was speaking about so here we see right it's a red and it's on our buy zone do not take this trade do not take this trade because now you enter and in this example it's going up which is good but other times it will continue falling so only take it if the colors correspond with the zone if the green is at the bottom you take the buy if the red is at the top you take the buy same with your main chart so you don't take a trade when the red is at the bottom okay i'll repeat that only take a buy in the buy zone when it's green only take the buy when it corresponds to the green on the main chart only take a sell when it's red in the sell zone and only take a sell when it corresponds with it being red on the main chart so this is a fairly simple strategy guys yeah. you just need to stick to the rules and the rules are also fairly simple you can make a lot of money with this strategy trail your stop loss always protect your profits don't let your red turn don't let your blue turn into red again okay so that's all for today guys a quick easy simple scalping strategy of volatility 75 go ahead like subscribe comment share it will really boost the algorithm on my youtube channel in order for these videos that i do make to reach more traders out there that is struggling with trading and that want to improve their trading skill so help yourself help others as well share the video like it takes literally two seconds click on the link in the description below and get access to the telegram group as well as my recommended brokers for these strategies